New tonight, it is official. A mobile home park in Euclid Beach will close permanently in 18 months. Residents now have to make alternate living arrangements as a park will be replacing the crumbling community. Our Lydia Espara has more. Gone are the fun days at Euclid Beach Park. No more rides. The coasters that were once a staple in the Collinwood neighborhood have long disappeared. What's left, the mobile home community, which has seen better days. We don't have a plan B because we did not know we needed one. Plan B in a year and a half, they must vacate. William Hartz has lived here for 15 years. I call it smart living because it doesn't cost me that much so I can afford a lot of more other things uh, in life. Hartz and many of the residents own their homes but pay for the rental of the lots, which averages four to $500 a month. <laughs> they are protesting the closure, but deep inside know it's a lost cause. We've lost more than just a say in where we live. Matt Zone is with the Western Reserve Conservancy. The WRC bought the land to keep it out of the hands of out-of-town investors. Six studies were done here. Reporting the infrastructure is dated, the plumbing has major issues, and many of the homes too old to move. Zone, a former city councilman, says evicting these folks is not easy. We're going to try to put them in suitable housing that meets, if you, if you have some sort of physical disability, we want to get you in better housing. They deserve to live in quality housing, and we're committed to doing that. About 100 families currently live here. 25% of the homes are already vacant. The Conservancy has been digging out of a financial hole ever since they bought the property. I hope by demonstrating that we have a social worker working in the park, meeting with tenants, that we froze people's rents, that we're going to compensate them fairly and justly. The plan is to expand this as a park with the library, conserving the green space and making it a space for everyone to enjoy. Hart just doesn't understand why it can't benefit both. Redevelop the area without moving all the people out. So by September 1st of 2024, everyone who lives here has to be off the property which will end decades and decades of mobile home living here at Euclid Beach Park, here on Lake Erie. In Cleveland, Lydia Spara, 3 News.